welcome to the KTBS3 Spirit of Christmas from Texarkana. Brought to you by the Texarkana Arts and Historic District. The spirit of Christmas in Texarkana is twice as nice because you have both sides of state line celebrating the season. This part of Texarkana has things to offer throughout the year. Great museums, great places to shop, places to dine out, and even some neat little places featured on Good Morning America offering some sweet treats. If you call Texarkana home, or really any place in this part of the country, you know where I am. The Parole Theater. She is almost a hundred years old and full of memories. He is forever young and smiling. Gabriel Perot, son of a great Texacana family taken in the dawn of life. A memory in a place that is full of them. I've been coming here all my life. I remember being able to meet Cary Grant the last time that he had a public performance and I was a little bitty guy. And they had Merle Haggard and The Temptations on back-to-back -back nights. Uh, coming with my mom and dad and my sister was seeing Roy Clark perform. Louis Grizzard. I never will forget seeing Louis Grizzard. I remember getting to see the great Martin Landau be Dracula. And at the very end of that performance, he sits up after they've killed him and scared me to death. And I did not want to meet that man. Everybody has a story. And if only these walls could talk. They would tell us of that grand day in November 1924 when the Sanger Theater opened its doors for the first time. During those roaring 20s, art happened here. Musicals, dramas, dances. Then, in 1931, the singer became the paramount, and the movies came to town. Gone with the Wind, Cleopatra, Dr. Shivago. It was the place to be for a young boy on Saturday mornings. Talk about mischief. We did plenty of mischief. We used to go out these doors and jump on the balconies, and they would come run us back in, you know, and so we'd take off and run, and they couldn't catch us. We gave ushers a terrible time down here. Television is born. No one wants to go downtown anymore. The Paramount goes dark in 1977. But then Gabriel arrives. Ross Perot and family say, this is a treasure not to be lost. In 1980, the old Sanger becomes the newly restored Perot Theater. And 40 years of art and music and memories begin anew. Fondest memory is of my daughter when she had her first uh, appearance in the Nutcracker. My parents came here, I came here, my kids have been here. We have such a gem right here in downtown and the beauty that it holds. I mean, you look up and there's no words to express. Is what a privilege our children have to perform and a music hall of this quality. They grew up here and they never graced the inside of the theater and they really cannot believe its beauty, uh, that, that Texarkana has something as, as magnificent as this. They get out on that stage and they feel like they're really professional kids dancing you know, in, in an amazing place, which they are. It, it, it's a placeholder in time and in progress. It's been here and it will be here because we've got to keep it here. You know, we know that the arts and the humanities are huge for young people to go on and to be successful and to do good, productive things, uh, not just in their community, but in their country. And by extension, they kind of help save the world a little bit every day. And we're gonna be back with more right after this. Brought to you by the Texarkana Arts and Historic District. 